We're here to talk about the March issue of Baltimore Magazine, our best restaurants issue. A new wrinkle this year, we're ranking them. I mean, in the past, we've listed the top 40, top 50 restaurants. We've never had the guts to actually say, here's number one, two, all the way down to number 50. There are definitely some surprises. I think there'll be some controversy. We want to get people talking, but people should know we worked so hard to get this list just right on, and we're very proud of our top 50. So also as part of our best restaurants, we're in the spirit of naming the best of things. We have the five best bartenders in Baltimore that we've chosen. And we had them choose their favorite drink and tell us a little teeny bit about themselves and sort of the culture of the bar where they are. And in fact, if you look on this website, you'll see that we've interviewed Brendan Darr, who is the head bartender at Ixia. And he makes some sort of delicious martini concoction for us. There's also a recipe for a drink right here in the magazine as well. In keeping with the food theme here, we have another story called Market Value, and it's about all of the little neighborhood markets in Baltimore. Baltimore is known for these great markets, and maybe people know the Broadway market and the Lexington market, but we take you behind the scenes of the Hollands market, other markets you may not know as well. Find out who's making what, what kinds of foods you're going to see there, fresh flowers, and it's just a huge part of the culture of, of Baltimore's culinary culture that we take a look at. It's hard to believe we have our spring home issue. I know it's a little cold out there, but we have our home section of the magazine filled with all sorts of tips and things you need to know for your home in the spring. We have a story on wind chimes because it gets very breezy this time of year. We have a story on mudrooms. People are actually decorating their mudrooms. It's not just a place to hang up your coat and kick off your dirty shoes. It's actually got its own style. Now there's pressure to have a mudroom with style. Who knew? There's a story on water ponds. More and more people are building these beautiful fountains and ponds in their backyard. So we're giving you a little glimpse at some Baltimoreans and some very creative water ponds. The March issue tends to sell itself. Everyone wants to know the best restaurants, but this one, I really think it's our best one yet. We had the guts to rank them. We love the ranking. You're going to love it. It's going to make you so hungry.